weekly update from the Super 80 here with Austin Nichols, Briarcrest High School, class of 2013. Austin, always a pleasure. Thanks for having me. Austin, since the last time we talked, uh, we just said it a couple of minutes ago, you've blown up. Mm -hmm. You've been on the radar of a lot of schools, but now you've picked up a lot of offers. First of all, just kind of put that in perspective for people who might be watching and listening. What's that like to have all that college attention? Well, I wasn't used to it at first. I had to get in the, you know, get in the mode of it. But once I started getting those offers, they seemed like it came every week. So now I think I'm up to 14, 13 or 14. But I just take it in stride. I don't let it get to my head. So just go with it. Your father was telling me you uh, got an offer from Florida, I believe, uh, Wednesday of last week. And you just got back from Knoxville. You took an unofficial up to UT. So what was that like? It was awesome. I mean, the whole coaching staff was with you the whole time. So you. They showed you around. It was a great experience. I'd love to go back up there and do it again. And you told me something about Neyland Stadium. Oh my goodness. Yeah, it's huge. It's got about 105,000 seats. And it's a whole different expect uh, perspective. So it's, it's good. So let's just talk a little bit about your hopes for the season. You're on an experienced Brock Press team. Uh, you've got two seniors who are going to lead you, and Chris Jones and DeMarc Richardson with yourself, Jonathan Wilfong. Looks like on paper you've got enough to make a deep state run. Mm -hmm. Oh yeah, we actually we got eight seniors, five juniors. Everybody's returning, and I think uh, the girls and guys are projected to win the state this year. So hopefully one of us will go far. Now that means this time you're not the hunter anymore. You're the hunted. The target is on your chest. That's more pressure. How are you going to deal with that? Just play as a team. We can't we can't have one man shows on our team. We gotta. We got to compete, but we got to play together, and that's how we that's how we play. You're class of 2013, so this is a little bit more appropriate question for you than some of the younger guys like 2014, 2015. College choices have got to start being on your mind. When are you going to start a preparing a list and then b cutting that list? Well, I haven't really taken a lot of thought to it, but uh, I need to do it soon. I mean, sooner the better, and I think I've I've started it a little late, but uh, I, I'll get right on that. Do you see yourself signing early, or do you think you're going to commit late, maybe in the spring of your uh, senior year? I'll probably wait it out, just see my options, because I don't want you know to sign and the coach leave, and I, I can't go anywhere. You know, it's just I'm gonna wait it out, and see see what's gonna go on. All right, well we'll be waiting out with you and enjoying the rest of your high school career, and look forward to seeing where you go for college. Appreciate it. All right, thanks a lot, Austin. Thank you.